What's up, you guys? This is Divine Messenger 33. Where I get messages from the Divine, I give them straight to you guys. So clear out any energy that will not benefit this message. Holy Spirit, Archangel Michael, my ancestors, my spirit guides, angels, and fairies, please give me clear and accurate Divine messages for Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Protect me as I get into the energy of Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. For the divine messages. Welcome all my supporters. I appreciate you guys for liking and commenting and subscribing to the channel. I appreciate all of the love, the support, the donations, the bookings, the emails. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support you show to me and the channel. I appreciate you. All right. All right, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Let's see what the messages are for you guys. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. All right, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Cancer, Pisces. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. All right, dog barking, advice from a friend. So you got some advice from a friend. Somebody could have a dog. Period of frustration, lessons to be learned. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, one more. Okay. Dark woman, dealings or relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair. Okay, and then we have sorrow over a loss. Okay, but let's see what comes out. Let's see. Something to do with wealth. Okay, so you do got wealth in your energy. Okay, so there could be advice coming from a friend when it comes to like a frustration, like situation. Okay, this could have something to do with a... A woman a, that's of dark complexion, darker than you. Okay, so somebody may be like frustrated with their money and shit like that. And I'm seeing like advice come from a friend on what you should do. And this could be somebody of a dark, darker complexion than you are. Okay, so let's get into it. Let's get into this energy spirit for Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. All right, yeah, nine of wands. Okay, don't want it to go in the reverse. Knight of cups in the reverse. So this could be like a lack of motivation. Uh, somebody could be very like, like unpredictable at this time, unreliable at this time. Five of pentacles. Yeah, so there could be some financial loss. Okay, going on. Nine of Pentacles. So somebody could be drinking a lot as well. Okay. And then we got Hermit. And we got Emperor. For some of you guys, this is somebody in your energy. Okay, this could be a father or something like that. Somebody could be taking care, taking care of a relative as well. This relative could be a drunk. Or somebody could just be taking care of a relative, an older relative that could need help or for some of y'all this is like the advice that you need like when it comes to a family member maybe you don't know if you should help this person or what you should do because somebody could be very like moody and you know it's like they have you know it's like this person could pile a lot on you okay so i am seeing like if somebody was going through some frustration with their money, I am seeing like some advice come come from someone that will help you get a wish fulfillment. But you have to be open to it though. Okay? Is what I'm hearing. Something to do with a Taurus, a Pisces, a Virgo, a Aries, a Scorpio, a Sagittarius. Okay, for some of y'all, 
If you've been hearing some dog barking, this could have something to do with, you know, with you. Or this could have something to do with someone that has a dog. Okay. For some of you guys, I am seeing you leave a connection behind. Okay. Because it was just, it wasn't reliable. It was a lot of loss. Okay. In the situation. And I feel like you guys are leaving something behind. And when you do that, I'm seeing you will have a wish fulfillment come in for you. Okay, once you really leave something totally behind, for real. Current energy. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, boundaries. For some of you guys, you could be working on your boundaries in a situation or you're led to recover. So I'm hearing if you guys are trying to recover from, from some shit, your angels could be nudging you to like really get into like setting boundaries because with you setting boundaries, that's actually going to help you recover a situation in your energy that could be frustrating you. For some of y'all, it's like you let, you let the wrong people in your energy. And when you let the wrong people in your energy, it fucks up everything with you. So I'm hearing for a lot of you guys, you need to be paying like extra close attention with who you have like come around in your energy and who you fucking with because for some of y'all it's people that you shouldn't even be fucking with and keeping your guards up for real for real okay you need to be some of these motherfuckers you need to keep them where they at okay that's what i'm seeing here cancer pisces scorpio Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Also, I'm hearing, be careful going out on dates. Okay? I'm seeing somebody go out on a date with a younger person. And it possibly not end very well. Okay? So, be very careful with that. Current energy for Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Balance. Look at that. Yes. So everything will be balanced in your life once you totally end something. Once you totally end something, you will get the balance that you crave, that you want. Okay? And if you already have done this, then balance is on its way to you. Okay? Balance is on its way. But... Yeah, that's what I'm getting. You're going to have to totally end something in order to get the balance that you want in your situation. So if you are still, still feeling like something is off, your angels are telling you to go within to see if it's something that you're not looking at. Is it something that you haven't totally let go of yet that you think you have let go of yet, but you haven't fully cut the tie? Okay. You still concerned about it. You still think about it. You still worry about it. That means that you haven't cut the tie. Okay? So for some of you guys, your angels are nudging you to really practice putting up boundaries in your energy. Okay? Because for some of y'all, that's the reason why you having a lot of frustration going on in your energy. Because it's like you letting in the wrong people that you should be leaving out. Okay, that's what I'm hearing. Some people you're supposed to be leaving out. You're supposed to be leaving them where they at. Okay. Something about funnel cakes. <laughs> I'm hearing something about funnel cakes. I'm hearing something about the circus or something. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. So definitely, whoever this person is that's going to give you some advice when it comes to your money, I am seeing like something come through though. So this is some advice that you may want to, you know, take in because this person going to give you, you know, give you something to where it's like you can make some money or something or make, make something that can help you out. So this is not something that you should be turning a blind ear to okay when it comes to this energy with this person okay 
Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Bottom of the deck. Somebody could have dogs. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Uh -oh. Bottom of the deck. Somebody can have thin eyebrows. We have social media platform. Somebody can have right arm tattoos. We have Scorpio. Multiple ear piercings. Jordans. 80s. We have P. Baseball cap. Something with Paula or Pauline. That air sign of hater. Gemini Libra Aquarius. Natural hair. Gap teeth. Something to do to Aquarius. Glasses and their contacts. Leo. Somebody could love wearing buns in their head. We have Libra. Professional. Thick eyebrows. We have A. O. Rap artist, Q, S, chest tattoo, drug addict, singer, mechanic, somebody could be dark skinned, miscarriage, Aquarius, Sleeve tattoo. We have P. Aquarius. I mean, Capricorn. We have thin. Somebody could be small. T. Boat or a yacht. Tone or muscular. Somebody could be high class. We have lawyer. Freckles. Short curly hair, nose piercing. Somebody could make clothes. This could be someone that have a boutique. Something about somebody making clothes or something like that. All right. Something about the saxophone. <laughs> Okay, something to do with 21. Somebody could have a child born in December. Okay, we have October 12th, October 10th, October 21st, February 21st, February 12th. All right, something about the SATs. SATs. Something about a pastor could be significant. All right, spirit. Something with Tasha. Something with PAQ. All right, something with PAQ. Something about a pap smear. All right. All right. Something about an op. Yeah, because for some of you guys, I am seeing like, it's like, there's an op in your energy. Sure is. For some of y'all, your wish fulfillment is going to come from when you ghost somebody. 
<laughs> when you go somebody, that's that's when your wish fulfillment is gonna come for you. But but I'm hearing you gotta make the steps first. Okay, something about the spa. Okay, so for some of y'all, you need a spa day or something. Okay, somebody needs to go to the spa. Okay, something about the spa. Okay, I'm hearing treat yourself. Okay, treat yourself, fire signs. For some of y'all, you could be needing like a, a break, a mental break, okay, in your situation. Okay, so that could have just been confirmation for you to go ahead on and get that massage. Okay, <laughs> go ahead on and get it. Something with AT&T. Something with Astasha. Okay, I heard Sangria. Okay. All right, you guys, I'm going to leave it there. I really hope these messages help assist someone in some shape or form. Okay, what's this? I see something about tap out. Something about tap out. Okay. <laughs> All right, you guys, like, comment, and I heard boxer, boxer. All right. Like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace and love.